Welcome back to Carnivore 411. My name is Matthew. Let's just take a moment, if you would, smash the like button, subscribe. We'd love to have you part of along my journey. All right, so what did I find today? Well, today I went, well, actually today I went specifically for pork rinds. Did a video a little bit earlier where we did the pork rinds. Yes, I did get these on my grocery haul. These right here cost two dollars and ten cents. They're really good guys. Matter of fact, hold on, hold on. <laughs> let me get. I mean, yeah. Hold on, hold on. I'm really pouring the taste for them. Okay. As you can see, I went to Kroger. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. I gotta tell you, they even taste better than when I ate them in the video earlier. Very interesting. Okay, so, at Kroger's today, these, these little buckets, here you go, bam! They're usually $1.99. It says they're good through May the 10th. Today's April, I think, 27th or 8th, something like that. Um, usually $1.99 with a digital coupon, $1.49. You can get up to five. I got two more. <laughs> I just didn't grab them all out of the fridge. Okay, but here was the thing I was most impressed with. So, I bet you can see that down there. All right. Right here. Now that's, that is a piece of perfection. Mm-hmm. Yeah. This is pork loin. Now, some of you watching this video don't know what pork loin is, or you never prepared it. So let me explain it to you. All right, basically it's boneless pork chops. Now you see the price on there, 1316, I believe you can. Let's see, it's right there, okay? That's how much it would usually cost, right. But it's $7.88. Hmm. Which means when we find it at that price, not only do we buy one, but we buy two, <laughs> and we buy three. Because when it's time to eat, it's time to eat. It is time to take advantage of getting a really good deal. Right? Yeah, it really is. No, I'm acting goofy, but it really is. And this right here, like if you take, okay, so $7.88, right? This thing, let me tell you how much, how much it weighs. 4.4 pounds. Now you can't, I mean, I can't, a fast food restaurant's gonna cost you like $12, right? Half of this amount is like, what, three seventy, dollars Something like that. Yeah. So, yeah, something like that. So, mm, anyway, let's just say $4, I don't know. So you, you're going four dollars. You can't eat half of that. Look at how many pork chops. So you, what you do is you take your pork loin. Pork loin. Ooh, let's get the black label. I don't know what that means, but oh, here it is. No, uh, no preservatives. No artificial artificial ingredients. Minimally processed. That's what I'm talking about. Twenty four grams of protein per serving. I don't even know what a serving is. Uh, there's a bunch of stuff on here about it. But anyway, and you got to be a Kroger's Plus member to get this. Interesting. Okay. So anyway, when you take this out of here, what you do is you cut your pork chops. You can put this in an Instapot, put it on slow cook. You can do them really thin, cook them for about five minutes in an Instapot. Oh my gosh. You're talking about just some falling off, of the, uh, falling off. Uh, just Marley. Stop. <laughs> You're talking about them just being so moist. It's incredible. And then there's a sauce that we've been making. Marley. So there's a, there's a sauce we've been making. Marley wants to talk. Uh, there's a, a sauce we've been making with the cheddar cheese, with the butter, with the sour cream, mixing that up on the stove. Oh my gosh. Ah, ah. So you know tomorrow I'm gonna be making some. Actually, I really should be making it today. Uh, you know what? I just might make some chicken in the Instapot 
and throw some sour cream in there. Oh, that was so good yesterday. Oh my gosh. If you checked out the breakfast from yesterday, um, I, went, I, I, I actually put that, um, I put the ingredients and the instructions in yesterday's. Yeah, I sure did. Along with a quiche. But yeah, this is um, pork loins, guys. Stock up. See, here's the thing. I mean, you know, this is what I always say. When it's time to eat, it's time to eat. And what I mean by that is that if you can get a good price, buy a ton. And then if you're not going to eat it right away, like these are good till May the 11th. It says, no, sell by May 17th. Like I can't eat these in over two weeks. That's almost three weeks away. So I can keep these in my fridge. And if it gets close to May 17th, I can chop them up, put them in freezer bags. Here's the thing though. I bought six pounds of pork loins the other day and I got a bunch of, of these already cut up in packs of four. So I'm already eating them like that. But today when I saw these, I thought, you know what? I think I'm gonna chop them up and put them in there and enjoy them. That's my grocery haul guys. Didn't cost me very much. As you know, with five of these, $1.49 a piece, do the math on that. That's a lot of sour cream. Yes, these at 210. Man, I just kind of want to go back and get 10 more bags. I'm just saying. And then the pork loin, I really don't have any more room in my fridge. You know, just being real about it. Just don't have any more room. I'm thinking about going to San, well, i thinking about going to get some whole chickens. Not sure. Not sure. I got so much else going on. I got the bacon, I got the eggs. I'm feeling good. I'm thinking about it. I don't know. Anyway, y'all be good. Just want to show you what I got. Peace out and I'll check y'all later.